So the start of this video may be a bit confusing just because I talk about my LL Goki Black dupe, which of course I mentioned in my tech type video. It was initially going to be in this, but I decided to go with a different video. And quick plug, it's the last day that you can buy my shirts. If you want to go ahead and do so, the link will be in the description down below. But I hope you guys enjoy the video. So I managed to pull an LL Goki Black dupe and it was just a completely random multi. I thought, you know what, let's try to get a dupe on a global version of the game like I managed to get on the Japanese version. So I got pretty lucky clearly and I managed to get him first multi, which is great. And I've tried to record this video several times now, but every single time something went, uh, went wrong. The majority of the time it was the audio. But regardless, I hope you guys are having a great day as always. And if you do enjoy today's video, consider leaving a like and subscribing if you are new. Now, find a rose friend, that would be great. Like the other times when I attempted this, I actually managed to find a 100% rose friend. But even if he's not one, I think that's the same one. Never mind. So we are going to be taking on a Super 17 event. And honestly, this team is just absolutely insane. From the times that I actually tried it out, it was pretty damn overpowered. And unfortunately, I kind of have to just get rid of that footage now because there is no audio to go with it. And there it is. We have a 100%. Rose, friend, and I initially was going to go with a double merge Marcy lead, but that just doesn't really work too well. I did try it against the newest boss, um, boss rush stage, and the reason why it didn't really work so well is because the majority of the time, Broly and Margin Vegeta just struggled heavily to actually super attack despite getting the key increase from the um, Rose and Goku Black, you know, passive. So I definitely think that this is the better setup for more consistent super attacking. You do get a bigger boost from a double merge Marcy lead, but I honestly think it's worth sacrificing that additional 20% just for more consistent super attacks because overall, despite not getting that much of an increase from a, you know, a friend lead or a friend Rose lead, you're still doing more in terms of damage because, again, the majority of your units are actually able to super attack. But yeah, hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Hope you guys managed to pull Elder Black into Marcy as well. Honestly, probably my favorite unit in the game alongside Ultra Instant Goku. Of course, we have Agility God Goku. How can we forget about the Agility God Goku? And the issue about this team against this event is that the majority of the units here have a um, melee, I suppose you could say, or melee, however you want to pronounce it, um, base attacks, which could cause a bit of an issue. But honestly, as long as we can um, consistently get crits during the first stage of the Super 17, you know, starting point. We should be fine, and now we are going to take on both Super 17s here. And we do have the Legendary Rare, which I'm actually going to build up. Actually, we're not even getting attacked that many times. And Marjorie Vegeta isn't going to super attack here, but this is by far one of the worst possible rotations for this team. We don't even have Goku Black or, um, what do you call it, Wait, Rose on this particular rotation, which again causes the terrible <laughs> setup. And it would be nice if my Goku Black could get hit a few times here. Merger Marcy should be able to take him out. Of course, they do share a ton of links with each other, so absolutely no issue. Super attacking. Honestly, the odd man out in this team has got to be Margin Vegeta, just because he legit shares, like, next to no links, even when it comes to, um, what do you call it? Even when it comes to ta uh, attack links, there are very few attack links that he actually shares with certain units. I believe his main one is obviously going to be Super Saiyan, just because that is extremely common. But apart from that, he just doesn't link up that well at all. And he doesn't even have first battle. So he did get the shaft, especially when it comes to a villain team. But again, he's still an absolutely phenomenal unit on this team in particular. It just comes down to whether or not you can super attack with him consistently, which we should be able to with the right rotations. Once I get them in play, obviously, because we should have Goku Black next turn. As long as we have a Super Saiyan Rise or a Goku Black in every single rotation, the majority of the units in the team should be able to super attack like consistently without any issues at all. I had to t um, tested it before, not this team in particular, and I didn't really go over my team. I would imagine that you guys saw right at the start. Of course, we have a 100% Merge Marcy friend and a 100% Super Saiyan Rose friend lead. And yeah, let's go over this. And then, of course, we do have the 100% um, Goku Black, 100% Roy's, and maybe one day I will have a few 100% Legendary Rares if I decide to wait on Global, which I don't know how likely that is. Okay, here we go. We are building up that attack, and I messed up. The 12 key attack is the one that lowers the barrier. Okay, this is going to lower the barrier at the very least, but I think Goku Black, the 12 key for the uh, Legendary Rare, Margin Vegeta, 18 key Broly are the only ones that lower his barrier here. And the reason why I know that is because I did this event a few minutes ago and I lost the footage. Well, I didn't lose the footage. The audio died. It's just so frustrating. Uh, frustrating. It hasn't happened in ages. I basically turned into Optimus Prime. And in before, I actually kind of sound like that now. And you wouldn't know 
Wait, and that is a super attack. But do I want to do this? Do I want to do this? Um, honestly, I need to get a super attack off of Marjorie Vegeta here. And this is actually a terrible rotation. Just do not super attack Broly. Hold up. Was that serious? No, it was, wasn't it? How did I... Did I just seriously get the 18 key there? That legit never happened. The 12 key hits harder anyway. If you're going to super attack someone, super attack Rise, okay? Because he can take it. Maybe. Oh, he takes so much damage from those attacks. Oh, boy. Don't super attack me. See, like... I think we're fine. And this is... This, this is definitely... A key attack. It's not. How? How is it not? How is it not a key base attack? This game is broken. This game is actually broken. How is it not a key base attack? Uh, this game is a lie. This game is actually a lie. You're telling me that's a physical attack? Carfax. What the hell? Okay. Like, I, I legitimately do not believe that. How is that? A you know what, Bandai? You do you. You do you. Okay. No additional. I don't think I've ever actually got an additional to go off of him. Which, again, isn't that much of an issue. But at least Goku Black... You know what? Goku Black, I appreciate you, okay? Because you are lowering that barrier. Slowly but steadily. And that could have been a double lower in. But it just didn't work out in the end. And before we get, like, a legendary rare Rose. Just a Super Saiyan Rose. And it's just not like, L back into Masu. Which is definitely possible. But I don't think they would do that. I'm actually surprised... Oh boy. I'm actually surprised they included Zamasu in it, but it makes sense, right? It makes sense. 97k, and we should be good here. Just about, of course. Right, um... Just... It, things aren't going as well as I thought they would be going. My loss attempt, by far, was way better than this, but let's go ahead and heal up. At the very least, Broly is going to lower the barrier, and I... I suppose it does make sense. I kind of wish that Rose's Awakened Super Attack was the um, Divine Lasso because it just looks amazing. But, well, I think... I don't know why they didn't make it the Awakened one. To be honest, I was back when they didn't put too much effort into the Super Attacks. If they release Rose now, and that is honestly something that could potentially happen. They could potentially release a new Super Saiyan Rose, which I wouldn't be opposed to at all. In before, oh, can you imagine? They awaken the current Vegito into... Yeah, they awaken the current Vegito Blue into a legendary rare hero lead. And then they awaken the Rose into a villain lead as well. I would not be opposed to that. I would not be opposed to that. And they give them the Divine Lasso as well, which would be dope. And that would mean that Rose would have two legendary rares, but it's not unheard of. I mean, we have Gohan with two legendary rares, so I suppose it's not that bad. And we are going to actually lower his barrier here with the um, LR. And the reason why is because his 12th key is actually, uh, obviously, a key base attack. Here we go. For a moment there, I thought it was the 18 key just because it kind of... I think the uh, super attacks start off the same when it comes to the 18 key as well as the 12 key. And sometimes I do get a bit confused. And this is taking way longer than last time. I was legit done at this point. So it kind of sucks. But we are about... We are legit about to get you Dolphin mode. That is how close... Look at how close we are to taking him out. We haven't even gotten to the last stage where he is the most vulnerable. And we are almost taking, um, taking him out here. Ridiculous. And who is going to deal the finishing blow? Well, of course, it's going to have to be Rose. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Of course, this team is just absolutely insane. I, again, was going to show it off on Boss Rush. And then the footage kind of died. So I thought, you know what? Let's make a bit of a shorter video and just show him off against the... Two, well, show the team off against the Super 17 event. Of course, we have to quickly go over the team. We have 100%... Two 100% two Roses. My own one and a friend one. 100% Merger Marcy. 100% Goku Black. Um, L or Black with the dupe. We have Marjorie, Vegeta, and Broly, and it's just an absolute phenomenal team. Definitely going to be using this team a lot more, just because it definitely is compiled of some of my favorite units now. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video, as always. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more. I'm going to set a hashtag for this video, and it's going to be hashtag L or Black dupe, and I just got insanely lucky. But I hope you guys managed to pull him as well, even if it wasn't a dupe. Just, just any L or pull will be great for you guys. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I will see you all in the next one.